Hi everyone, uh, Dave here from uh, Off The Grid Adventures. Um, yeah, welcome to my channel. Uh, this is just a very short video on uh, a bit of bow hunting. Um, I don't do a lot of bow hunting here. I mostly use rifles, but I thought I'd film this because um, at the moment there's a, there's a mob of feral goats over in the valley there. And uh, feral goats in Australia are a big pest as well, along with pigs and rabbits and a few other things. So um, you've got to keep their numbers in check. Saying that though, they're worth a lot of money to the farmer. You're getting over $100 a head now for, for live goats. And they um, they get sold on the halal market, I think. So a lot of them go to Indonesia and places like that. Okay, so the bow is just a, a cheapy uh, recurve. Um, I'm using these um, cheap bamboo arrows. I think you buy about a dozen of them for about 30 bucks posted. Um, I'm using the Bodkin style um, broadhead. It's just like a sheet metal one, but they sharpen up quite nice and they work very good on goats because they're quite thin skinned. And uh, oh, yeah, these arrows they haven't even got a proper knock on them, like they've just got a notch in the bamboo with a bit of string wrapped around them. But they, they work all right. And most of the time, you, you fire an arrow up here, it's a one shot use anyway because it, if it hits the animal, the animal will roll around on the ground and break the arrow, or it'll hit a rock if you miss. So, so you pretty much a single shot, so they're only cheap and. They work. Um, the bow is just a takedown 50 pounder, and um, yeah, hopefully, we can get pretty close. And um, I'm not real good with this bow, but I can hit like the end of a Coke can at about 10 meters, so that's that's pretty good. And I don't shoot much past say 20 meters on a goat size animal, so yeah, let's go hunting. Fucking hell. Break the fucking arrow there. Fuck it. Pretty sure I hit that goat. Give it a few minutes. Okay, I found the arrow. You can see she's got blood on it, but she's also got shit. So that means tangled it through the gut, unfortunately. Well, that was a bit of a balls up. Um, I haven't taken this bow out for about five or six years, and the um, the arrow rest fell off after the first shot, and. Um, I still managed to hit the goat, but it hit it a bit far back in the guts. So I had to go after it. All right, and let's go and have a look at that goat. Here you have it. Oh, it's a, it's a billy. It'll do for dog meat. 
Oh, there's the arrow st sticking out of it still. Not the best sort of um, bow hunt, unfortunately, but um, we've got a good sized billy. I'm uh, going to take the legs for the for the dog, and I'll uh, cook the back straps up for myself tonight. And um, yeah, it should be all right. Um, yeah, I was using these bamboo arrows. The arrow broke off inside. It was quartering shot, the last shot. But um, one of the shots actually went low, the first shot, and, and got him angled through the guts, unfortunately. But um, didn't suffer too much. It was all over pretty quick. So that's the bow hunting, guys. All right, I'm going to get the car now.